What's good, YouTube? Eliante, not the diamonds. Um, today is Wednesday, March 29th. I am currently packing for a cruise I'm going on. So, um, I leave on Friday to go to Florida. My cruise is late to Saturday, but I like to pack early so I can, um, so I can just know, like, what else I need to get for last minute stuff. So, I ain't gonna lie, before I turn the camera, I did already start packing, but. Um, when y'all pack, do y'all like fold everything out first and then you put it in your suitcase or do y'all wait? Yeah, let me know down below. But, um, so my current situation is I have, I'm taking what, six pairs of shoes and I have a, a lot of clothes because it's a seven day cruise. So what I'm thinking I would do is I can put these shoes in this little suitcase. It might not fit. We're going to figure it out. And I'm going to put all the clothes in here. But I'm going to the camera back up in a minute after I put the clothes in there and try to do a couple things and let y'all know what ended up working out for the shoes and the clothes and everything. But this video just consists on me packing and then me going to Florida. And then that video should be up Saturday morning because I want to get something out to y'all before I get on the ship because when I get on the ship, I will not be uploading. Well, I ain't gonna say I won't be uploading, but I probably won't be uploading. So I'm gonna put the camera back up after I pack some stuff and let y'all see how it looks to see what else I have to do to change it. So that did not go as planned. So probably what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave I'll probably leave this like this. And then like but look at my ease. My ease is scrunched up in here like some bread or something. I'm gonna put these three in here with the clothes. <clears throat> because I had the same I had the same problem every time I go on a cruise. Uh, I have to have two different bags of shoes and whatnot. But should I put the clothes? I'm gonna put the shoes in there first a certain way. I ain't gonna lie, really. The thing I like about 350s is they're flex. They're so flexible, so I could probably just put the 350s on top of these right here, so we can get those in the same, in the same, uh, in the same bag. And I'm gonna put this shoe and that shoe in the this suitcase. So I'm about to um do that, pack the whole bag, and I'm gonna show y'all how we packed. And then I'm gonna show y'all if if some of y'all do not cruise. I'm gonna show y'all some little essentials that you should get when you go on your cruise. Because I ain't gonna lie, it's a lot of little things here and there that you need to get that a lot of people do not tell you about. So I'm putting the camera back up in like two seconds for y'all. All right, y'all. So I do now have everything packed up. I'm gonna show y'all, but um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna just show y'all. So what I did was I put the forces in uh in the blazers in here. And I got, oh, I got a hoodie on top of this. I got all the other shoes in here. So under here, we got what's called the in it, but. So I ain't gonna lie. Like I was saying about those cruise essentials, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna just show y'all two things that are very underrated. This is for anybody, like, I ain't gonna lie. Look. This sun bum, this sunscreen, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Need this, bro. Then I got the uh, face too. You know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if everybody the same about their skin, but. You know, the worst, it, it'll be like very bad for you to go out there and all that sun for seven whole days and you come back sunburned because in other countries, in the middle of that ocean, that sun is not the same as the sun here in the United States or whatever, wherever. It's not the same. So, um, I'm probably pick the camera back up if I do have anything else to pack. If not, um, okay, so one thing I did forget to mention is <clears throat> even though like you will have your luggage tags like on your bag, right? I would recommend that you put one inside the bag because if you're, um, most people, a lot of people do staple their zone or they use a little luggage tag clips. I take mine under my bag because I don't want anything coming off. But if you're, a worst case scenario, your luggage tag does come off, you'll have the uh, paper in there so you won't have to worry about having to go to the lost and found and whatnot to find your, um, to find your luggage. So, I'm gonna show y'all. I am gonna blur it out because, not because my name is on there, people know my name so I don't really care, but because my room number is on there and this is definitely going up before I go, before I get on the ship, so I don't want anybody to know my room number or anything. But, you put it on here like this, and then you just simply close your suitcase. Boom. So, I will put the camera back up in the next clip and, we, and it will be Friday and I will be on the way to Florida. So I will see you on the next clip. So it is Friday. I almost forgot to put the camera back up, but currently about to, well, I'm about to bag gone. But I got my small bag. I got a bag right there. I got a bag right there. But about to head to Florida. So 
ain't too much to say. I'm just gonna roll some B-roll. And that's because we will be in Florida. Might be a short video. I'm trying to stretch the video out. But I'm gonna come back up in a minute when I'm on the way to Florida or at the gas station or something. I don't know. So now in Florida, the video is short because there wasn't nothing going on. So now in Florida, as you can see, around, um, staying about 30 minutes from the port. So I'm, I'm sorry the video is short, but it's like, it was nothing going on really. I'm just, I was going out of the stores, getting snacks, sitting in the car, riding here. Uh, seven hours later in Florida, I was staying near some airport. I think it's like, I think it's like Melbourne, something this airport right there. But, Tomorrow, we board around 10.30, I believe. So I'm probably wake up around like six or seven. My hair probably messed up too, I had a hoodie on. But probably wake up around six or seven and get on the ship. And I'm gonna um, I'm a vlog embarkation day tomorrow. And that embarkation day vlog is gonna, and it's gonna carry over until my first day in Mexico. So I'm gonna put the camera back up. Well, I'm gonna put the camera back up. I'm gonna catch on the next video when I am in Mexico. No, not when I'm boarding the ship and in Mexico. So y'all stay tuned for that. Um, y'all for tuning in and depending on how the wi-fi is on the ship i might drop uh videos while i'm on the ship if not this video is dropping tomorrow on the first and then i will drop again on the eighth if the wi-fi on the ship is not good but if it is good i'll probably drop again sometime next week so i appreciate y'all for watching i'll catch y'all in the next one man all right y'all so i know i did say in the last clip that the vlog was over but i did just go downstairs and grab some wings so um i'm currently standing in um hilton melbourne it's like Hilton Melbourne, it's like 30 from the port. If you need somewhere to stay and you don't, and you can't like stare by the port because you wait last minute, Hilton Melbourne. But I went down since I got some wings and I'm about to, I haven't seen the wings yet and I'm finna show y'all the wings. Uh, it look good to me. But me personally, I'm an all flat type of guy. So I got all flats. They are garlic parmesan wings and I've never had this flavor a day in my life, but they didn't have the flavor I wanted. So I'm gonna try these out. And matter of fact, let me, let me grab one of these. They decent, but um, they are decent, but I'm actually gonna. Like in the vlog this time because I am done for the day. Not doing anything else. I'm about to eat this food, edit this video so I can have this video up in the morning. So y'all seeing this. What well, this video is getting uploaded on the first. I don't know when you're gonna watch this, but tomorrow's embarkation day, so I will vlog that and I will carry it over to my Mexico like I said. But uh thank y'all for tuning in. I will catch you on the next one. Me no I blow English.